Hello everybody, Arjun here. Welcome back to Kerbal Space Program 2. I've reloaded the previous mission. I just want to see if I actually can land or if my if it was my mistake or just weird physics. In the previous game, you could disengage the heat shield, so you can just jettison it. Get rid of it. Apparently in this game, uh, you cannot. That option is not yet available. So far, I'm finding out that um, getting the first game is better right now than uh, the KSP. The first game is much better than KSP 2 at this point. I guess it is still in early development. And I'm afraid to accelerate because I'm not sure if that's what caused the issues last time. Let's slow down at about 1,000 meters. Close enough. Taking too long. Our speed is 9.1, so it shouldn't. I think this. I guess he can't see here, but I'm pretty sure the tolerance was higher than 9. Point, or it's exactly 9 meters per second now. And yeah, I wish you could just jettison each shield. And that's not even the problem. I think last time the problem was it fell on the side and then I couldn't recover the vessel. Anymore. Okay, this is taking too long. 0.9. 7. I mean, there's no way that any sh anything should be damaged. Ooh. So yeah, I have no idea what happened. Um, it must have been because I was in the acceleration mode. I didn't switch it off quickly enough. Okay, menus really need to have a lot of work done on them. Okay, can I recover this now? Yes. Confirm. We should have a lot more science available. Okay, let's see. 374, nice. Can I just start concentrating on the next one? Because, yeah, I can just skip all of this. There, I mean, what's the point of any of this stuff? I can just get better parts in here. Yeah, remote guidance unit, so better probes. So basically, just go down the first line and you can ignore the rest of it. Get science points quickly enough. I guess I should probably eventually get the smaller research. I think it's lighter, right? That is 0 0.05 tons. One ton. So yeah, this is much lighter. Atmospheric science. Atmospheric survey is that different than what does this do? Hmm. 
designed to be completely configurable. What does that mean? I guess I never tried. So what I can do with it in the build menu. Uh, let's, yeah, let's unlock the medium orbital rockets. Medium launcher, I do not have enough for that. I could get the smaller times the junior, junior. Because that is quite a bit a bit of weight from one ton to point zero let's get that Space race. Were we? Yes, the heart is the only agency participating, but it's still an achievement. Okay. 150 more. So I guess I, uh, I should have grabbed this mission. Next mission is to actually land on Mon, right? Yeah. Grab mission. Will it actually show up on screen? Well, we'll see. Space walking. Well, I've already done this, but I guess it doesn't retroactively finish it. EVA while in carbon orbit. Plant to flock within any air on the moon. One. Establish an orbit around carbon within A, P, and P. Can I just adjust the satellite I have now? I don't know if I have enough fuel. Uh, craft mission. Station. We have a bunch of DOE. Anyway, uh, where was the mission? It's been tracked, but I'm not seeing... Where am I supposed to look? Am I missing it? Or is that something that's not been enabled? is quite horrible. There's mission tracking. What is this? There we go. Secondary missions. Uh, establish an orbit around Kerbin. I mean, 99 and 101 we have... We need to go down a bit on our... Apoapsis. Theory apsis needs to go up. 
I don't know if I have enough fuel to do this. Let's just shorten it in that. Oops, too far. Periapsis is too low. Oh, yeah, I went past them. Except it didn't finish. Uh, it doesn't have to. I'm wondering if this is not going to work. What is going on? Oh, it switched places. That's the. out of power. I don't know if it's even gonna... No, we have electricity. Why does it... Done. Oh yeah, we actually finished it. Perfect. We still have a bunch of fuel left. Probably need to finish the mission, don't we? Uh, perfect circle, submit. Well done. Uh, we 
were able to show a circular orbit still has a high and low point by using heat from our mission. Our lawyer also did a compelling demonstration of a hula hoop. Uh, now we need to make an eccentric orbit. I can actually do that with the same probe. I'm pretty sure I have more than enough fuel. It's another hundred signs, let's do it. something fell on the ground um i guess it doesn't matter but anything okay i see uh that's our why does it say unknown that's our space center right Anything around Mon left? No, I think it crashed. Um, what do I do? Take control. Oh, nope, that's not good. Periapsis is fine. AP of 300 to 8400. To warp here. Wait, we can reposition. Actually, that's gonna be in the dark, so we're gonna start losing power. Hopefully not too fast. And yep, there goes all the power. I yeah, I should have put more batteries on this. I don't remember if this uh, rocket engine actually generates power. It might. Another hundred signs for fifth. So, next step is to try and land on Mon. Well, let's see, what can we unlock? Medium lunches, better engine. Or, oh, it has a lot of max thrust, 1600. That's a heavy lift. We probably will need that. Because I do like to over-engineer have extra fuel. <laughs> Except I'm missing six points of science to get that one. Fuel lines, nice. I I probably want to grab that. And electronics. 
I do need more science tools so I can get more science data. But for now, let's grab a few lines. Hopefully, we have everything we need. Plant one. I don't really think it matters in this game if you have one herbal or more than one. I, I, I know in the previous game, in the first one, it mattered if you had like a scientist, engineer, or a pilot because they were able to do better maneuvers and stuff. If it was a pilot assigned to it. A scientist collected more science points. But I'm not even seeing... Any description next to the Kerbals. Training center? No, that's not... That's not it. Can I not see what Kerbals I have? I guess I can just assign them, but it doesn't actually... Uh, where's Jebediah? Oh, there's Jebediah Kermit. Why is he not in the first spot? He should be assigned to every mission. He was like the uh, iconic character in the first one. But I, I'm guessing at this point it doesn't matter if you have one, if you have three, if you have fifty. Uh, as far as I can tell, there's no point of even bigging, building a bigger rocket or herbals. So just using a single seat one is probably fine. We are trying to land. That's probably gonna go horribly. Um, it has a little bit more monopropellant. It's slightly lighter, but impact tolerance is lower. I'm just gonna use this. Then we'll come back with it as well. Actually, it doesn't say I need... It needs to be a manned mission, does it? Though we need to plant a flag, which we do require a Kerbal to be present. Whoa, that's a big thing. Does this have RCS built in? Well, let's check. Enable RCS. No, it does not. I guess I could look in their description, but that's a pain to get to. Or figure out. Uh, yeah, it doesn't say that. I guess the bigger one probably does, right? Reaction wheel. RCS thrusters, yes. That's one benefit for a bigger one, but that is so much more mass. No, that's fine. 
RCS thrusters. Maybe on the rocket itself. We'll do that. So science. How small is this? Can we just catch it? That's gonna be extremely unbalanced, I'm guessing. And what did it say? It's very modular. Right? Data reports are not Oh, no, I guess this is... It says modular, but there's nothing you can do with it. So that's just a description, nothing else. Yeah, designed to be completely configurable, but there's no options whatsoever. Okay, um... Yes, um, it doesn't even matter how much of the rocket comes back. Not in this game. The previous games, the more stuff you landed with, the more money you could recover out of it, but there's no money involved. Space missions yet. Probably in the future. Do I need an extra reaction world? We'll need probably RCS for landing. There are pre-built one lander not really what is that oh that's one of my designs Let's take a look. What do we have? Uh, this is a small engine, and this is three. Um, can I change this to? No, I can't. I was wondering if you could change this to C delta V on Mon, for example weight to frost ratio but no we can only do launch pad one two three four runway so you kind of have to guess or just over engineer everything i guess same here i can't look up what the frost to weight ratio on mon would be just on the surface Not overly impressed with that. The decoupler. Then we need a heat shield. Just in case. That's the only thing we have. Maybe on the outside, I guess. That's horribly not aerodynamic, but that'll do. Next. Let's see. Another coupler.
Uh, I think I'm gonna stop this video here. I'll still build this. And the next video, we'll try and land on the moon. See how that goes. Nice. We have the fuel lines. That means we can have multiple uh, liquid fuel engines instead of having to use solid state fuel. Uh, okay, I'm gonna stop this video here. Thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please consider subscribing. Maybe hit that like button, leave a comment. I'll see you all in the next one. Bye.